Greetings everyone and welcome to the first episode of Coat Energy's Chargers Classified. Where we bring you up to speed on the latest and greatest of EV charging in Singapore and prove to you why charging your car is just as simple as charging your phone. So grab a seat and something to eat as we unpack all that and more. Thank you for joining us. I'm Aaron Hayward and over here is my colleague Jolie Tay. Each episode will sort through the most compelling of charges and answer your burning questions. And no better way to kick off this mini-series than with the Bursi Charge AC Wallbox from Siemens. So here we have the unit. This is the 22 kilowatt model, but there is also a more gradual 7.4 kilowatt version available, but we'll touch on that a bit later. It's an AC charger suitable for residential or office use. It has a Type 2 output plug suitable for any fully electric or hybrid models in Singapore. It is a very robust design, so it will withstand almost anything you throw at it due to its high water and dust protection rating. But there is something else very special about this charger. That's right, Aaron. This charger does come with a seven meter long cable and that is an additional two meters longer than most regular ones in the market, giving you greater flexibility wherever you may want or greater flexibility if you just a bath at parking. Yes, that's very handy. But how do we visualize the charging process? Well, I'm glad you asked. It incorporates open charge point protocol, which may sound boring to most, but simply put, it is the same concept as your iOS on your iPhone. Your charger connects to the software, which is translated to you as a smartphone app. You will have full access to this, which will allow you to monitor and manage your charge at the swipe of your finger with driver authentication, consumption tracking, protection, and more. And what are the requirements? Well, coming back to the two models Siemens have released that I mentioned earlier, if you have a single or three phase electricity supply, you're eligible to install either the 7.4 or the 22 version. Okay, well, how long does it take to charge and how far will that get me? Well, with this model right here, the 22 kilowatt, you're looking at a full charge within two to four hours, depending on your vehicle model or battery capacity. You'll be able to do upwards of two laps around the coast of Singapore. Just plug it in, set it and forget it, just like your phone. But whatever you do, don't go fiddling around with your electricity box. All installations must comply with all Singapore standards. Make sure you get a licensed professional or give us a ring here at Colton and we will take care of everything from utility approval to permits and installation. We've got you covered. Well, that's all we have time for today, folks. So thank you for joining us on our first episode of Charges Classified. If you got something out of today's video, make sure to like, subscribe, share, and comment any future particular EV charges you would like to see on here, and we'll work on bringing that content to you. We'll see you next one.